What's up, K-pop fans? It's your dance mentor here, Don, and we're gonna be doing a special reaction today. Uh, not really special, but it's slightly different because we're gonna be checking out NCT's Ten on his choreography piece to Taki Taki, which is by DJ Snake featuring Selena Gomez, Ozuna, and Cardi B. And I know this was requested or loosely requested a while back and I haven't really gotten to it just because there was just so much videos that have been suggested to me so yeah we're I, I kind of am um, excited because the last time I got to do this was uh, reacting to and sorry it was 17's Dino's um, and, and his old choreography, choreography series and I know that NCT 10's um, has quite the library of pieces that I'm going to be reacting to. So I'm kind of excited. Um, so yeah, we're going to be more focused towards uh, the movement and the choices and the artistic vision um, of this piece rather than just the formation and, and the cleanliness because I feel like this is really, I can't really say, oh, that's unclean. Uh, this is his own choreography and his own interpretation to his movement to the music. So with that said, before we get into this video, um, a large amount of you guys who watch my videos are unsubscribed. So it would mean a lot if you hit that like button and also subscribe um, because it's free and you can always change your mind. But other than that, let's just get right into this video, NCT Tins. We'll go through two runs, so we're gonna watch it and then we're gonna review afterwards. <clears throat> Love the Cardiff Bucky hat right there. Nasty already. He did not press the unplay button. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, we got a little bit of a dance hall feel to this uh to this piece. It's pretty nice. Um so far, I think I really, really appreciate his capacity in, in his movement. And we'll go over that a little bit more, but um, just to briefly explain why is that there are some parts to this choreography where he absolutely embraces his hips and also the feminine. Uh, I wouldn't say like this is like a feminine dance at all. Um, it can be or, or, you know, it's very again, it's open to interpretation, but I think his hips what sold me. So we're going to check this out again one more time. And pause in between. Complete presence here. I'm loving it. Mm. Mm. Mm, I just love how that's just set the groove so much already. Taki taki room and just goes off. Uh. 
Like, I just love how he's so loose and just ready to go here. Mm. Yeah, see, this is the part where he starts utilizing his hips. It was just so sensual and so uh, striking. And, like, okay, when... It, usually when, like, there's this... In this type of genre of a song, like there's this constant groove, there's this constant rhythm. And right off the bat, in the beginning of his choreography, he slows it down. Oh, it just opens up so much presence already. Right here. Boom. Oh, I just like. Nice. Like, I also appreciate um, the amount of effort and execution that he's bringing because it's, it's easy to groove, but sometimes it can get pretty tiring to groove, but um, still being able to dance bigger. And right here, he's really... He's really elongating most of his motions. Uh, and it I can see it a lot more. It gives his moves much more dynamic and and feel. So. Yeah, just like again, like he's just really he knows how to um, groove out the fluid motions especially like when it comes to the body rolls and or utilizing like a hip sway like this whole section right here uh man like the fact that he's arching his back now most guys I'm, I'm telling you most guys can be pretty shy of doing that even even myself um because you know it's not within like our own comfort zone but right here he is committing and I appreciate that. Nice wordplay there with the candle stuff. Ah, oh, dude, I just love how much space he's using, especially in this part. He's just playing into character. It's not even him dancing. It's just like this is his character. Uh, way to be in not only within the pocket of the song, but the pocket within the character. Uh. Ugh, look at that that's just so ugh. he's using everything there you can't you can't fake that mm. and then he missed the play button <laughs> just kidding it's all jokes i want that bucket hat maybe i should start wearing bucket hats most of the time you usually see me wearing like Cardiff beanies, but anyways, oh man, I'm excited to see more. I loved it. Um, I know so far I've only noticed in terms of, in terms of dancers within NCT, um, of course I pay attention, like a lot of people pay attention to Young or, or Mark, but I don't really get to see personally the other members in the group in terms of their capacities as dancers. So um, there's going to be a lot more NCT 10 reaction videos. So keep a lookout for that. But again, let me know in the comments below what you guys thought and suggest to me like any other 10 videos or maybe any other vi videos that you would like to see. Um, and if you did like this video so far, can also hit that like button and also subscribe that would mean a lot and it lets me know what you guys like um but with that said thank you for watching and i'll see you guys next time on another nct 10 video and stay eating y'all
Peace.